In computer science, type conversion, typecasting, and coercion are different ways of, implicitly or explicitly, changing an entity of one data type into another. This is done to take advantage of certain features of type hierarchies or type representations. One example would be small integers, which can be stored in a compact format and converted to a larger representation when used in arithmetic computations. In object-oriented programming, type conversion allows programs to treat objects of one type as one of their ancestor types to simplify interacting with them. Each programming language has its own rules on how types can be converted. In general, both objects and fundamental data types can be converted. In most languages, the word coercion is used to denote an implicit conversion either during compilation or during runtime. A typical example would be an expression mixing integer and floating point numbers, where the integers are normally converted into the latter. Explicit type conversions can either be performed via built in routines or via separately defined conversion routines such as an overloaded object constructor. In most ALGOL based languages with nested function definitions, such as ADA, Delphi, Modular 2, and Pascal, conversion and casting are distinctly different concepts. In these languages, conversion refers to either implicitly or explicitly changing a value from one data type to another, for example a 16-bit integer to a 32-bit integer. The storage requirements may change as a result of the conversion. A loss of precision or truncation may also occur. The word cast, on the other hand, refers to explicitly changing the interpretation of the bit pattern representing a value from one type to another. For example 32 contiguous bits may be treated as an array of 32 booleans, a 4-byte string, an unsigned 32-bit integer or an IEEE single precision floating point value. While the storage requirements are never changed, it still requires knowledge of low-level details such as representation format, byte order, and alignment requirements in order to be meaningful. In the C family of languages and ALGOL 68, the word cast typically refers to an explicit type conversion, regardless of whether this is a reinterpretation of a bit pattern or a real conversion. See like languages. Equals implicit type conversion equals implicit type conversion, also known as coercion, is an automatic type conversion by the compiler. Some languages allow compilers to provide coercion. Others require it. In a mixed type expression, data of one or more subtypes can be converted to a supertype as needed at runtime so that the program will run correctly. For example, the following is legal C language code. Although D, L and I belong to different data types, they will be automatically converted to equal data types each time a comparison or assignment is executed. This behavior should be used with caution, as unintended consequences can arise. Data can be lost when floating point representations are converted to integer representations as the fractional components of the floating point values will be truncated. Conversely, converting from an integer representation to a floating point one can also lose precision, since the floating point type may be unable to represent the integer exactly. This can lead to unintuitive behavior, as demonstrated by the following code. On compilers that implement floats as IEE single precision, and ints as at least 32 bits, this code will give this peculiar printout. Note that one represents equality in the last line of the printout. This odd behavior is caused by an implicit conversion of I value to float when it is compared with F value. The conversion causes loss of precision, which makes the values equal before the comparison. Important takeaways float to int causes truncation that is removal of the fractional part. Double to float causes rounding of digit. Long long to int causes dropping of excess higher order bits. Type promotion, one special case of implicit type conversion is type promotion, where the compiler automatically expands the binary representation of objects of integer or floating point types. Promotions are commonly used with types smaller than the native type of the target platform's ALU prior to arithmetic and logical operations in order to make such operations possible, or more efficient if the ALU can work with more than one type. C and C++ perform such promotion for objects of Boolean, character, wide character, enumeration, 
and short integer types which are promoted to int, and for objects of type float, which are promoted to double. Unlike some other type conversions, promotions never lose precision or modify the value stored in the object. In Java, equals explicit type conversion equals, explicit type conversion is a type conversion which is explicitly defined within a program. There are several kinds of explicit conversion. Checked, before the conversion is performed, a runtime check is done to see if the destination type can hold the source value. If not, an error condition is raised, unchecked, no check is performed. If the destination type cannot hold the source value, the result is undefined. Bit pattern, the raw bit representation of the source is copied verbatim, and it is reinterpreted according to the destination type. This can also be achieved via aliasing. In object-oriented programming languages, objects can also be downcast, a reference of a base class is cast to one of its derived classes. Using overloaded object constructor. C, in C, type conversion can be made in a safe or unsafe manner, the former called check type cast. Eiffel, in Eiffel the notion of type conversion is integrated into the rules of the type system. The assignment rule says that an assignment, such as, is valid if and only if the type of its source expression, y in this case, is compatible with the type of its target entity, x in this case. In this rule, compatible with means that the type of the source expression either conforms to or converts to that of the target. Conformance of types is defined by the familiar rules for polymorphism in object-oriented programming. For example, in the assignment above, the type of y conforms to the type of x if the class upon which y is based is a descendant of that upon which x is based. Equals definition of type conversion in Eiffel equals, the actions of type conversion in Eiffel, specifically converts to in converts from a defined as. A type based on a class C U converts to a type T based on a class C T if either, C T has a conversion procedure using U as a conversion type, or, CU has a conversion query listing T as a conversion type. Equals example equals, Eiffel is a fully compliant language for Microsoft.net. Prior to the development of .NET, Eiffel was already equipped with an extensive class libraries. Using the .NET type libraries, particularly with commonly used types such as strings, poses a conversion problem. Existing Eiffel software uses the string classes from the Eiffel libraries, but Eiffel software written for .NET must use the .NET string class in many cases, for example when calling .NET methods which expect items of the .NET type to be passed as arguments. So, the conversion of these types back and forth needs to be as seamless as possible. In the code above, two strings are declared, one of each different type. Because system string does not conform to string 8, then the assignment above is valid only if system string converts to string 8. The Eiffel class string 8 has a conversion procedure make from SIL for objects of type system string. Conversion procedures are also always designated as creation procedures. The following is an excerpt from the string 8 class. The presence of the conversion procedure makes the assignment semantically equivalent to in which my string is constructed as a new object of type string 8 with content equivalent to that of my system string. To handle an assignment with original source and target reversed. The class string 8 also contains a conversion query to SIL which will produce a system string from an instance of string 8. The assignment then becomes equivalent to in Eiffel, the setup for type conversion is included in the class code but then appears to happen as automatically as explicit type conversion in client code. The includes not just assignments but other types of attachments as well, such as argument substitution. See also, downcasting, dynamic cast, type punning. References External links, casting in ABAP, casting in ADA, casting in C++, casting in Java, implicit conversions in C. Implicit type casting at preference.com, static and reinterpretation castings in C, upcasting and downcasting.